functional components requires a different approach compared to class-based components. Here are three common methods. 1. Injecting a provider. Global store. Utilize a state management library like views. Define the global property as part of the view store and inject it into your functional component using the provide and inject options provided by the composition API. Custom provider. Create a dedicated provider component that holds the global property. Inject this provider component into your functional component and access the property through its exposed API. 2. Using application configuration. App. Config. Global properties. In view 3, you can add a global property directly to the application configuration using app. Config. Global properties. Access this property directly within your functional components render function or setup function. 3. Context injection. Advance. Provide context. Create a custom context using the provide and inject options and store the global property within this context. Inject the context into your functional component and access the property through its context API. This approach is more complex and generally recommended for scenarios where a dedicated context is needed for specific functionality. Remember, choose the method that best suits your project structure and needs. Avoid overusing global properties and favor local state management when possible. Ensure proper documentation and maintainability when employing custom provider methods. By understanding these techniques, you can effectively access global properties within your view functional components and build reusable and well-organized applications.